What is up everybody, I'm Moritz and I'm a Shopify developer from Germany and I'm on the lookout for the best looking websites which are out there on the web. My mission is it to make it as easy for you as possible to try to recreate them and today we will be having a look at the website of White Coffee. They have this nice little playlist, playlist scrolling text section right here and if you hover over it you can see the albums which are going to redirect you to their Spotify and you can pretty much link it to everything but the way we will be doing it today we build something similar as well, but we make it a bit more e commy So if you hover over it, you can directly get to the product itself. And we're not going to do anything crazy. We're not going to use code. Instead of that, we will be using an app called Section Store. And with this, you can do it completely yourself instead of having to pay for expensive developers like me. You can just get the app for free and then get this section for a one-time purchase of $9 and you have all the customization options in the world, which is pretty nice, stating the fact that it's not going to slow your store down or whatsoever, and it is also working on every theme. So after successfully getting the section, just head back to the My Sections area of the app where you can find a collection of all the sections you're owning. And here we have the one, and before you can actually use it, you have to click on Add Theme, add it to the theme you are using, and then simply just open that up right here that's the one you've seen in the beginning of the video and if you would want to start completely from scratch just click on add section right here type in scrolling text and then it's going to be the scrolling text 9 but i filled this one with a little bit of content already and i'm going to show you how it works so if you click on one of those empty blocks right here you can decide in which row it's going to be so the maximum capacity of this is going to be three rows, but we're just going to use two. We could add another one right here. So here we're going to have sunset and the picture we will be selecting will be, of course, something a bit more orange looking. Let's just go for this one. And here we have the second row selected. And in the next one, we are also going to do the second row. In the other row, I selected row one. That's the top one. And here we're just going to pick something nice as well. Let's maybe do this one and name it T-shirt. And here you can see if I hover over it, I get the T-shirt. And the same principle goes with the top ones as well. And I also want to have an URL to that. So we're going to pick the T-shirt it's representing. And now if I click on T-shirt, it's directly going to bring us to that page. And if I want to do some customizations to the main thing itself, I just click on the main block, the scrolling text, and here you can already see essentials for you. And it's going to update live. Always make sure to save every now and then. So your progress will get shown. And here we can also tweak the size a bit. Pretty much everything you see is fully customizable. Of course, the whole, the whole thing is fully responsive as well. As you can see right here, it does look really nice on mobile as well. So if you have over it, you can see that too. And if we're going to go back to desktop, we will be able to see the headline right here. Products. Plus, just wanted to show you that it's directly getting updated. So that's one nice thing. We can make it a bit smaller. Also, you can decide if it's going to be mobile or desktop, which is the changes getting applied to. You can decide if it's going to be slower or faster. Let's make it really fast. Just wanted to show you that. But I'm happy with that. And yeah, a bunch of other things as well, like that. It will synchronize a bit more and yeah, a bunch of other things we could do. And if we scroll all the way down, we can see that all the colors are customizable too. So if I want to have the background black of the button, that's no problem at all. Here we can do the whole thing back just to show you that this is also possible. Now I also want to see the, the subheading, of course. Yeah, now it looks a bit more techy, but I do like this look and I hope it kind of gives you an idea that everything is possible with this section. And now we're going to save it all up and have a final look at it in the live store. Let's open this one up right here. And if we scroll all the way down, we should be able to find our new section. And here we can already see the products and I click on the t-shirt it should direct us to the page i assigned it to and that means it all worked perfectly well hope you guys found it useful and if you did give this video a like and a follow have a good one